Hey everybody, assalamu alaikum. Welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for joining me again. Today I'll be trying a few different types of chocolate. I'm just in a chocolatey mood, so let's do this. And yes, there is no proper intro because I can't find the clip. I don't know if I forgot to press record or something. So this is Future BB editing the video and I'm literally so shocked I can't find the clip, but I decided to put these cute little pictures of me with the chocolates as I made the intro. So yeah. Let's do this. So guys, I do have a few chocolates with me in stock, in my BB Choco stock. And guess what? It is that time of the month. I am craving chocolate. I was going to eat all the chocolates without trying them out with you guys. But I was like, BB, just do it. You have to have a BB Choco review, right? So, before we go any farther, make sure you like this video and subscribe down to my channel. Now, we do have quite a few chocolates we'll be trying, five different types, so I'll just go through them with you guys, one by one, but this is all the chocolate. So, I feel like we should st oh my god, I forgot one more. <laughs> this was the chocolate delight I was missing, Lottie Choco Pie. Oh my gosh, and you know what, I actually sort of cheated because these are individually packed, so I opened it up this side and just had one, just one. But since I did forget it, we're going to start with it because it's amazing. So guys, this is Lottie Choco Pie and we open it up right here. Yeah, so I did open it up this side because I just wanted us to experience this side, but I was really in the mood of some Lottie, so. I got one, so this is what it looks like. It's basically having some chocolate, some cake. I believe this is like a soft cake. And then marshmallows. And trust me, it tastes absolutely divine. Just open it up. It sort of looks like, you know, like a muffin, the top. Break it in half to show. So yeah, it's amazing because we have some chocolate, some really soft layer of cake, and then in the middle we have the marshmallow. Now, taste, I'll just have to taste it again. Mm. It's really nice. <laughs> Okay, I'll just keep this. So, it's really soft, it's such a snack, you can literally eat all at once because this pack does come with six, you can see right here. Yeah, you can literally eat them all at once and they are individually packed so you don't have to sort of worry about it getting um, aerated or anything. You can just get one a day, although it's quite hard. But if you like something really soft, not too heavy, Lottie Choco Pie. So, so nice. I just feel like finishing it up. But let's go on to the next. Um, we could go with some dark chocolate, because I do love dark chocolate. Um, let's just see how much cocoa this has, the percentage. Um, it does say dark chocolate, so cocoa solids, 39% min, minimum, I guess. So let's have this. I usually used to use this for baking back when I used to bake a lot. So, oh, it smells divine. And I didn't show you the packaging, I'll just do that. This is Cadbury Bonville dark chocolate. It's a classic, especially the one in this packaging because the new packaging that I haven't yet actually tried. Look at the color, so classy. It is dark chocolate, so you know really loves that. Put it out. It's all mushed, but you can see it's Cadbury, Cadbury, Cadbury. I won't touch the rest. It should taste amazing. Just break off. Whoa, okay. Just keep it. Mm. 
Okay guys, so this is dark chocolate. It is sweet, it's not bitter, and it was um, 39% so that's not too much. If you did watch some of my previous videos, I have tried dark chocolate that's basically 100%, 70, 85. Now that had no sugar as well, so it was quite bitter. The higher you went in percentage, this is quite sweet. It's nice. Yeah. Next. Next, let's try this. So this is a E. Weddell chocolate. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it correctly. And it is dark. So this is dark creme brulee flavor. Dark chocolate with creme brulee flavor filling. I'm excited to try this because I haven't tried creme brulee chocolate. Flavor chocolate. <laughs> Wait, what? Okay, I haven't tried dark chocolate that is creme brulee flavored or any type of chocolate. But, but this is really specific. It's dark. So this is what it looks like, really cute. Look at the zebra, look at this little man, a woman. And then this is the creme brulee, so it's sort of showing us what to expect. So this has 50% dark chocolate, so I'm, I'm thinking the cocoa percentage is 50. Let's find out, we'll taste it. We just need to taste it. It smells sweet. I can't smell the dark chocolate. Chocolata! Chocolata! Mm. I did have this in the fridge, but it seems to be quite soft. Okay. So, this is what it does look like. It's been in the fridge a while. It did get squished, because I do sort of get my chocolates. Put them in the fridge, but I guess they squish each other. You guys are squishing each other, okay? It's not me. So let's just. Ooh, it smells sweet. I'm so excited. Sweet, sweet, sweet. This is nice. Okay, so it is having this sort of, I feel like a little bit of a crunch, like a sugary, crunchy bit, and then bits that aren't are just sort of like creamy. So I'm thinking it does taste like creme brulee, like the flavor is sweet and So the flavor is, the filling actually is creamy and I'm getting, I'm getting that, you know, that hard sugary top coat that creme brulee does have. I feel like it's there. It is sweet and the, um, the dark chocolate is not bitter, but it's not being too sweet. So you do get a good sense of sweetness from the inside filling and I feel like I tasted a crunch. But yeah, you can see it has different sort of layers. So you do have different sensations when eating it. It's not just one specific filling. We have the crunchy sort of sweet bits and then the creamy sort of bits right like here. This is actually nice and something unique. It's all melting. I can't decide what's my favorite. Mm. These are nice. Okay. I'm going to try not to lick my fingers. Next we do have water brick chocolate and it is one of my favorites, milk chocolate with hazelnuts. I do love milk chocolate having a bit of a crunch, you know, some hazelnut. Sometimes we have like biscuity fillings. I'm thinking of Kit Kat, but yeah, I love my chocolate to have different sort of feelings. Not all the time do you want a smooth sort of taste. So this is from my bro, Sam. Love you so much. And thank you. It's huge. It's the size of my head. It is bigger than my head, and I have a big head too. <laughs> this is really big. But yeah, thank you so much, bro. I miss you so much and love you lots. Now, onto the chocolate. Oh, how am I going to open it up? Huge. Oh. So I can smell the hazelnuts. So I did sort of break it in the middle, but let's hope. 
okay. I'm just sticking out with that in my case. I'm so afraid of it. Of the broken half. It's actually quite heavy and I did break it right here. But you know it's quite difficult to keep like a really big bar of chocolate. It just sort of breaks somewhere. Okay, so I can smell the hazelnuts. You know when chocolate has like some nuts in them, you can actually smell it. So yeah. I'll just break off a piece to keep up with the sort of golden yellow color you can see right here. It's on this golden little tray sort of thing. The color is really pretty by the way before I get into this chocolate because we have some brown and yellow gold sort of vibes. Sort of like my top and my um, color choice for today. Some brown, some yellow and some gold sort of vibes. Look at that. Look at that, it's so pretty. So, let me try and get a piece. It does have quite a few hazelnuts. Crunchy. I love crunchy. Okay. Chocolate on my teeth. Mmm. Okay, so the milk chocolate is really nice. It's smooth. I love when the chocolate is smooth. This milk chocolate is really nice. It's really smooth to the taste. And then we're having the crunchiness from the nuts. It's amazing. Ooh, it's amazing. You know what? I'm going to keep it here with my choco pie. But I have to finish this. I have finished all this. And my creme brulee. So I'm saving all this up to eat. Amazing. So this is really nice. And the packaging is nice it's literally the perfect gift to get somebody so i absolutely love it last i was going to say next but it's last and yes i do have chocolate on my fingers i'm trying not to lick look creepy so this is cadbury's ps chocolate and these are actually really cute i've not tried the caramel but i've tried the rest and they always have cute sort of messages right here they can have like i love you and all that and when you do scan this it takes you to a website and when I did scan it, but this was like two years ago, it took me and I could sort of make a little cute message for my friend or whomever. And that was really nice, so scan it. It does say layers of wafer and caramel flavored cream smothered in Cadbury caramel confection. So let's try it out. Caramel. Caramel and milk. white chocolate the caramel you can see the layers of the wafers are they smothered yeah they are mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. this is nice and this caramel is interesting let me see if I like it Okay, so it's nice, crunchy. Um, the caramel is sort of white chocolatey. And I feel like there's a hint of saltiness. But just a hint. It's nice, it's unique, it's so different. Each of them have actually been so different. So, let's just brush up on what we've tasted. We'll not taste it again, but just show you guys. So, we started with Lottie Pie. I actually got this when I was sick. Um, one of my besties brought it for me, but I was too sick to sort of want it, like to taste it. And then, I forgot I had it, but that was in August, so it's not it's not a long time ago. But now they're amazing. I can't wait to like eat it all up. We had Cadbury. Well, it's not in a particular order, guys. We had the Cadbury um, PS wafer sort of chocolate, and then we had the dark chocolate, the Bonville. Let me drop this. Then we did have this E Widow creme brulee dark chocolate, which tasted amazing. I got it as a birthday present as well. How could I forget all this? All I could remember is this huge um, water bridge because it's the last chocolate I got from my bro. So that's all that was in my mind. I was like, yes, this is so, this is huge. But these as well, like literally, look how much I'm loved. Alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah. Yeah, guys, so that's it for this video. I'll see you next time. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below which one is your favorite. If you've tasted them all, I literally can't choose because they're all so different. 
literally they're all different i'm happy with all of them yeah don't forget to hit that notification bell to get notified each and every time i upload i'll see you next time this was fun i got to taste my chocolates i'm literally going to go eat more but it was fun to spend time with you guys i'll see you next time love bb Chocolate is good for the soul. Bye guys.